All right, team. I'm going to show you three exercises to help with the rotator cuff. The rotator cuff can present with pain that's on the side of the shoulder, and it affects your function with overhead activity, reaching out to the side, or any type of movement that really involves stability to the shoulder. The rotator cuff really helps to glide the shoulder where it needs to go, and it helps stabilize it and work collectively with the other rotator cuff muscles to get the movement that you want. So here are three exercises that you can do to help strengthen the rotator cuff overall. You might have shoulder pain right now, these may help. You may want to strengthen the joint itself to prevent shoulder pain, these can help as well. So you're gonna use a roll towel and you can, can use a band, you can use a pulley, you can use any type of resistant system from the gym or a, from your home. We also have tubes available that you can use as well. So you're going to take this down to about elbow height. So from about elbow height, you're going to take the roll towel and put it under the arm. And all this is is a walkout. So you're going to keep the arm perpendicular to the body, and you're going to pr provide three small steps out. This is going to require the shoulder itself to stabilize, to hold that. Those external rotators to the joint itself have to hold, 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 hold. So it's providing this isometric contraction. A lot of times the rotator cuff itself will provide an isometric contraction to hold the joint where it needs to be while it's gliding and moving. So it's important that with the, with the, the bands that we're using that we're replicating similar movements that we may use in life. I'm going to also show you the second exercise, which is the same, but for internal rotation. So we're going to be pulling in. I could do this facing this way that's not going to help you. So we're going to do it facing this way. Under the elbow again. And we're going to go from here, same thing, perpendicular to the body, and we're pulling in. There are four main muscles that make up the rotator cuff. This assists in one of them. The exercise on the other side assists on the other two. So we're hitting three out of the four, actually, four muscles just with this activity that we're providing right here. So again, we're going perpendicular to the body, we're going under the elbow, and we're going to provide light step outs or walk outs. Okay, third exercise that we're looking to do to help with the rotator cuff is we're going to provide our band above the head. We're going to bring it above the head. This can be a doorway, this can be a pulley at a gym, it can, it can be a band, it can be a tube, but we're going to take this band on the target arm we're looking at, and we're going to pull it right to the side like so. So by pulling to the side, we're keeping the elbow straight, and we're really activating all those scapular muscles. The muscles to the shoulder really are assisted by the rotator cuff muscles and the scapular muscles. They work collectively, called a force couple, to help move the joint up overhead, out to the side, or stabilize in front of the body. So again, we're keeping the elbow straight, and we're pulling right to the side. Slowly up, slowly down. We can provide more or less resistance based on how much of the band that we grab from. The farther away, it's going to be easier. The closer, it's going to create tension sooner. So we have variable resistance. So again, these are three exercises you can do for the rotator cuff. The rotator cuff is very important for the overall health of the shoulders to be able to push, pull, carry, and lift. So it's important that whether we preventatively assist the rotator cuff with some of these exercises we provided today, or you may already have that rotator cuff pain that's on the side of the shoulder or the joint that's causing that dull ache. It's hard to use with normal daily activities. So these are three exercises that you can start doing to assist with your shoulder health. All right, team. Thanks for watching today. And again, keep moving.